Hello everyone. Today we will be going to solve problem from educational code forces round 84 dated for division 2. Sum of odd integers. So you are given two integers n and k. Your task is to find if n can be represented as a sum of x distinct positive odd integers or not. So basically what we have uh, given is our integer n. We have to find out whether the n can be represented by exactly k, k number of k distinct positive odd integers so let's go to the code and code it out so we are told that we have to take an integer t the number of test cases the next t test cases will contain integer n and k so it will be the numbers and the k distinct positive odd numbers and for each we have to output yes if n can be represented as a sum of x positive integers and no otherwise so let's go to the code and code it out first include bit slash stdc plus plus dot h using namespace std int men so you have to take t number of test cases in t c in t while t minus minus the number of test cases for each test cases we have to take two integers int n and k so if both n and k are positive or odd okay so for that if n mod 2 equals to equals to k mod 2 if both are of the same that is both are positive both are even or both are odd and and k uh, the square of k should be less than equals to n what we'll do we'll see out yes and l else see out no we'll return zero let's take the input let's run it yes 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 no yes 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 so basically you can see see if someone hasn't understood let's uh, dry run a problem so if we take these three examples okay so both of 3 and 1 are odd numbers and 1 into 1 is less than 3 less than equals to 3 so it is true means yes similarly both uh, 4 and 2 are even and 2 into 2 is less than equals to 4 then it is also yes and here 10 and 3 is one odd number what even number so it is no so let's download the code and run it let's submit the code So what we have to do is take the variables as long long so for that we will initialize define ll long long then it will be ll n and k so let's run it let's download it and let's choose the file and submit it yes it's accepted so thank you and we will see you in the next video